Edmonton is the capital of the province Alberta. Here are top 12 places to visit in Edmonton. Number 1, Alberta Legislature Grounds. The legislative building located there is the meeting place of the Legislative Assembly and the Executive Council. Free tours of the facility are offered throughout the week. Alongside that, there are many events held there throughout the year for all special occasions. Number 2, The Art Gallery of Alberta. The Art Gallery of Alberta is an art museum in Edmonton, its collection includes over 6,000 artworks, with a focus on art produced in Alberta, and other parts of Western Canada. It offers public education programs. Visiting it is a great way to learn more about your country. Number 3, Elk Island National Park. This is a national park in Canada that played an important part in the conservation of the American bison. It is Canada's eighth smallest in area but largest fully enclosed national park, with an area of 194 square kilometers. There are many activities to do there such as going on hikes as long as 15 kilometers. Or you could enjoy the view alongside the beautiful lake there and go boating in it. Number 4, Edmonton Valley Zoo. The Edmonton Valley Zoo is owned and operated by the city of Edmonton and is open 364 days a year, closing only on Christmas. The Valley Zoo's Elephant House is home to Lucy, a female Asian elephant who was orphaned in Sri Lanka in 1975 and came to the zoo at the age of two in May 19, 1977. Number 5, Ukrainian Heritage Village. The Ukrainian Cultural Heritage Village is an open-air museum that uses costumed historical interpreters to recreate pioneer settlements in east-central Alberta, Canada, northeast and east of Edmonton. Number 6, Fort Edmonton Park. Fort Edmonton is an attraction in Edmonton, take a horse-drawn wagon through the settlement era on 1885th Street, where you can say hello to the animals at Otwell Farm, or stop for freshly baked treats at the Jasper House Bakery. Get a first glimpse of modern conveniences on 1905th Street, the municipal era. Visit the home of Alberta's first premier, catch a ride on a vintage streetcar, get your picture taken in historical costumes, and test your gaming skills at the Penny Arcade. Number 7, Old Strathcona. Old Strathcona is home to a vibrant independent theater scene, with nine theater companies operating out of several buildings in the neighborhood. Old Strathcona is also known for its art house theaters. Old Strathcona has a year-round farmer's market that requires all vendors to be primary producers. Edmonton's market garden industry finds an average of 10,000 customers every Saturday. Number 8, West Edmonton Mall. West Edmonton Mall is the largest shopping mall in North America. There are over 800 stores and services including 9 attractions, 2 hotels and over 100 dining venues in the complex. It is truly a very time-consuming trip once you're in this overwhelming place. Number 9, Fairmont Hotel McDonald. The Fairmont Hotel McDonald, formerly and commonly known as the Hotel McDonald, colloquially known as the Mac, is a large historic luxury hotel in Edmonton. Hotel McDonald includes 198 guest rooms and suits spread throughout the building. Number 10, Narnia Ice Castles. The Narnia light display is made completely from icicles, hundreds of thousands of them, and is truly unlike anything you've ever seen before. Sit upon a frozen throne, crawl through ice-carved tunnels, slip down an ice slide, and see it all in colorful glory when they turn on the LED lights. Just make sure you bundle up, it's an entire kingdom of snow and ice. Number 11, Botanical Gardens. The temperate and arid showrooms and native people's garden is surrounded by hundreds of species of beautiful herbs, flowers, and ornamental vegetation. A short 40-minute drive from downtown Edmonton, this lush outdoor getaway is the largest botanical garden in Alberta. Open during the warmer months. Number 12, William Horolak Park. The park has walking hiking trails around the perimeter which can be used for cross-country skiing in the winter. There are picnic sites, a playground, and beach volleyball nets on site. In the winter, you can go ice skating in their Lake Victoria or visit the Narnia Ice Castles.